testing, testing, one, two, three. I'm good. Hello. Oh, All right. Are we, are we live? You should have oh, told wow. us that. <laughs> Hi, how is everybody doing? We're joined here. Loser's Quarters of Aeon Meta Edition. A Ao dog. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it is. Aeon X Meta. Yeah. I'm Visceral. I'm joined by Mini. And we got Loser's Quarters. I believe this is top eight for seven. No, I think this is for fifth, actually. Loser's Quarters. Yeah, yeah so yeah. it's for fifth. Amaryllis rocking the Bayo game one against CT on running. Wow. Yeah, that's a very interesting oh, choice. Oh, well, it's not going very well. But, this might need a bit of time to just run it up. Yeah, so. Amaryllis hot off a win on uh, Rock. Too well. Oh, that was, that's awesome. Good on Rock, though, for getting seven. Yeah, no, that's, uh. Okay. Oh, all right, he knew that spacing. <laughs> yeah. Does Even if he got a. Patient? Oh, my God, again. Yeah. Even if he did get it. Oh, again? Oh, he missed all the time. Even if he did get the spacing a little off on that F smash, though, it would have been the sour spot at least. Mm. Emerald is really, he really likes to do a lot of witch times when he's ahead. It's fair because, like, he um, does like a lot. Like, there's another one. Yeah, Zero, Zero Sun catching up onto that. Yeah, it's like a trend of his. I always notice. And I wonder why he just, like, uses it so often. Because I feel like after a while it gets predictable. But, like, oh my god. That was, <laughs> that was interesting. Because after a while I feel like it just gets predictable. Yeah. Okay, nice job holding down. Right. I saw an amazing tweet today. And it said, uh, screw the person that decided to make up these uh, go above the ledge like that. Lucina's, Mario's, Shoto's. It's so bad. I hate it. I hate it so much. I think it's good. Yo Yo would be. You can't two frame them. Or you can, but it really depends. Because it extends their hurt box. That's true. And it makes it snap right away. So it actually makes two frame look really easy. That's the risk. Hmm. Yeah, that's true. If you don't get the two from you get hit though, then you can't let trap. Oh, nice. He's at dangerous percent. Oh, the back air with him. I don't think that would have killed anyone. That was a PS2. Yeah, and Zero on slowly putting that damage back on. Uh, you see one of Bayo's weaknesses here. Uh, yeah, he struggles to kill. But uh, off stage, this is sort of the place that Bayo is able to get that kill. Yeah, I mean, there's a bit of hill options for like a raw smash, a back air by ledge, or like he could witch time. He was witch timing so much before that uh, if, uh, ZTN on this Roy is able to uh, catch out a witch time and call it out with like that smash or something, uh, he's gonna die because ZTN has a full rage right now. Mm, that's no. Uh, he, has, sweet spot. He, has, he didn't do the um, he did all red. Mm. Uh, as did. Yeah, didn't need to go for the second, third one. Ooh. Oh, okay, okay, reason roll. <laughs> that's a, something a lot of That's players crazy. Do. I thought he F smashed in the other direction. It's an interesting thing about the Yeah, the animations are kind of wacky. But, oh, we got Bayo combo. Only getting 25. Yeah, out of that from zero to fun. Destroy. Yeah, but zero to none bringing this back after being in such a, at such a deficit. Yeah, he was at a really good deficit. I think Amaryllis took the first stock at like 30. And now he's in the lead. Those witch times kind of slow the pace down there. And the Lilith's just trying to find his way in, get some of this uh, some of these Bayo combos started, and this oh. is definitely gonna start something. Yep, now it's an even game. We got forward throw. This ledge trap's gonna be big. Oh, does it get a combo started? Oh, uh, ZTM doing a good job of getting back Ooh, to the Ooh, I think he drops uh shield a bit early. Yeah. And ZTM doesn't seem too familiar with the Bayo matchup actually, because he tried to punish that uh the witch twist. Yeah. That's something that I had to learn going in because, you know, I I played Bayo, I didn't play Smash 4, I wasn't used to the Bayo matchup, and every time for a while, I just kept getting hit by the back air when I'm the list would go for the, um, the Witch Twist from Ledge. Yeah, that's a, something tricky that Bayo likes to do. The higher percents gives her stage control. That's a good option, but last hit. Roy, Roy is probably at last hit. Amaryllis is able to Amaryllis get is there. definitely at last yeah, hit against Roy. <laughs> Especially with the rage. That's one thing about Bayo that's tough in this matchup. Is well, Roy, if he gets the sweet spot, it's last hit. Yeah, Roy is a machine with like rage. Like yeah. Yep. Roy is a machine with rage. Almost full rage there. Bayo is no. super, super light. Yeah, honestly, I just think... um. Amaryllis was struggling to kill, and that's really what did it. Yeah. And uh, Zero Sinon was able to bring it back pretty quick. Oh, nice. I feel like he showed his cards with Tiong. Um, but it's kind of a little too soon. He, he started doing them around like 80 or 90, which is a lot. Mm. And I feel like that would have been better. He got scaled out. Yeah. I think that would have been better at like 
closer to a uh, kill percent, like more reliable kill percent, where like something like a back air or a smash from pretty much anywhere would be able to kill. I think that's closer to like 110 maybe. Oh, okay. Right, Emily also <laughs> signing the camp a little bit. Um, but ZCM getting that first hit there, continuing this combo, waiting out that witch time. Ooh, all right, so the second hit of Nair is going to hit us, and then tries to up the other shield. But uh, this is where the combos start. No, not going to finish off. I guess he missed his jump. That, player totals. that frame one air dodge from Bayonetta is going to get him out of that one. Tries to go for a witch time, but doesn't come out quick enough. Okay. Yeah, Bayo's air dodge is frame one. Is it? <laughs> is it? So, uh, Bayo's air dodge? Yeah. Yeah, it's the only frame one air dodge in That's the game. That's ridiculous. Yeah, it's the only one. And then there's like a few characters that have frame two, and then the rest of frame three. I'm pretty sure. And uh, Bale also has bats with him. It's busted. Ooh, down smash. Yeah, gonna get the two frame there with that yeah. down smash. I think because um, ZTN was holding down a lot, maybe he extended his hurt box up to make that easier to hit. Mm, yeah. I think that's what happened there. Because he was holding down a lot in the last game. Good job from Amarillo to recognize that, though. Oh, yeah, definitely. And that, that was like the first time he went for it, too, right? Yeah, yeah, it was. Usually, uh, Bales will be pretty liberal with that. Um, not not usually, just sometimes. Oh, he is running away with this. Not making the same mistake. Well, Around now, he started going for a lot of witch times. But he's at 100 now. So... Oh, oh not able to recover well. there. So now Amaryllis, he's got a two-stock lead. Yeah, and he's got some rage building up. The next combo is going to do a lot of damage. <laughs> that was oh, good, though. That will kill. Yeah. That was the sweet spot. But Amaryllis still has got another stock to work with. Good recognition from Amaryllis there. Uh, with that grab, though, to realize, like, Zero to None's probably thinking the same thing. So he went for the grab knowing that Zero to None was probably going to shield, being scared of the uh, full rage bail combo. And Z team was able to turn that around. Okay. So, so despite the fact that Roy has some of the best ledge trap in the game, Amaryllis has been getting all of the ledge pretty free. Yeah, I'm not really seeing a lot of, like, jabs. Coming. That's another thing, yeah, we haven't seen any jabs. Um, yeah, that's like one of his best like spacing tools. In neutral, so his best ledge trapping tool by far. F smack not gonna reach. Yeah, no. But uh Amarils can afford to go for that. Uh because here it's not super high percent and he's got another uh, stock to uh, help. Oh the guns. Him. Okay, that's Ooh, okay. Not that's gonna kill quite yet, even with full rage on Bale. Uh, what was the cross to see? That's the thing about the sweet spots. Ooh, sweet I don't spot. think he wanted to go for the uh, the stage there. He wanted to go for the ledge. Yeah. Which I think if he didn't air dodge, he would have been fine. Oh, yeah, really oh. if it's going to work that time, that was the first witch time that I've seen yeah. in a while. Amaryllis, and because of that, yep. Amaryllis with a clean one stock is going to take that game too. He did a really nice job of being way more conservative with his witch times, I think, to close out these kills because he was kind of struggling. And um, I think that was the big difference between game one and game two. Um, still a close game though. We're running it back to PS2 for game three. Bayonetta, I want to see if he's going to Zelda. Yeah, he is. So quite a different matchup, quite a different pace. Um, Zelda's pretty explosive too though, so. Uh, it's also going to be a mix up. Yeah, <laughs> you just said it, I'm sorry. <laughs> I was commentating a lot before. It's all so. good. There's yeah, no worries. Um, and this is ZTN's main. Yeah. Oh, he can definitely wish to me. <laughs> I don't think he's going to be able to ever Does get like Does Amaryllis know this matchup pretty well? Seems he's playing very patient, um, which I've got to say, definitely the best way to play against Zelda. Oh, yeah. You need Zelda to. approach you. You need to. Her, on a big stage like this, Zelda's Phantom only controls a certain amount of space. So if you stay outside of that space, or you take her to a big stage like this, you have way more room to work with. Also, Bayo has the ability to wish time on. Yeah. I mean, he, he shouldn't really be, like, close enough to punish, I think. Unless he's, he reads, like, uh, Zero Denon's trying to go in for, like, a grab. Maybe if he conditions him to start grabbing by shielding all the fans. But he's not really doing that right now. Yeah. Um, yeah very the thing is, like I said, it feels like Zero Denon doesn't know the Bayo matchup as much. And to be fair... There's two people that play Bayo uh, on Hong Island. Red Robin oh. and Masato. Yeah, Masato doesn't really come out as much, I think. Yeah, no, he's super good, well, too. Well, he does but... go to the city, and um, there's purity there, so... Oh, I, yeah, I don't know about the city. And yeah, the city purity is insane at Bayo. But I'm not sure how often they play. I know purity goes to uh, Bombs, the Monday one, a lot. Mm. And I don't know how active ZTM is in that. 
I know he's he goes to more of the uh, Wednesday. Oh, that up that was very Chris smart. Thought. Yeah. Yeah, you gotta be really careful. Respect. It's, respect a, it's a different is this type of teleport recovery. Oh, All right, F so smash. You gotta respect yeah. that F smash too. <laughs> Um, Respect is the name of this matchup for both of these characters. Unlike like Halu and Mewtwo's teleport recoveries, where you can just like sh uh, nonchalantly throw out like a rising aerial yeah. uh, to cover that two frame, uh, Zelda's has a hitbox on it. Yeah, and it kills very early, <laughs> especially by the lid. Oh, walk back F smash, ZTM getting stage control back. Trying to really read a neutral getup, but. Great mix up from uh, Z uh, not ZTN, Amaryllis there. Um, getting back to Ledge. But uh, it looks like ZTN has a little lead here. Oh, tries to go uh, for the Witch Time. Not going to pan out the way he wanted. Yeah, I'm nice double leading out. Reads the air dodge. Yeah, and it's going to get the uh, sweet spot back air, and that's going so to take Amaryllis' uh, second stock. So now Amaryllis on his last stock. For the tournament. Still very doable, though. Bale Ooh, the dash not going to catch trouble. him. Bale's going to have some trouble if she doesn't start racking up some damage. But that's, that's exactly damage, what Amaryllis yeah. is doing. Yeah, but you need to get that kill. And, you know, that's where Amaryllis is going to need to figure it out. Yeah, zero to none. I feel like he might have, or he really needs to respect which time right now. That's so important. Ooh, Ooh okay. all right. Great timing on that uh, Nero's love. Well, Amaryllis tried to um, do the witch time to try and counter the up B, but... Going to legs, you're not very smart decision. And Zelda's at 130 right now. I think um, Amaryllis is currently waiting. Ooh, not gonna kill. About to say, it seems like Amaryllis saving Witch Time and Phantom for like a last stock situation because he's really down here. Yeah, he really is. Um, Zero to None's doing a really good job of like knowing when to shield. He's really respecting Bayo's combo game. Um, Maybe not as much on the lead. Oh, All right, which that's time? Gonna be that's it. huge. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. So now we're at a last stock situation. Amaryllis has a lot to make up, but with Bayo's combo game, he can definitely do it pretty fast. Yeah, and he has the rage. Just a couple oh, combos. No. Oh, no! Wow. He went for the witch time. Uh, zero to none whiffed spot. it, and he, he was able to land with...